What's up guys? How are you? I hope you're great. My name is Jesse and welcome to yet another amazing tutorial today where I'm going to cover how you can actually export coordinates of a polyline from AutoCAD to Excel using an automatic lisp, you know? That's what I'm going to show you today. Let us dive into the tutorial straight away. So guys, as you see from this AutoCAD drawing, I have 0 0.1, 0 0.2, 0 0.3, 0 0.4, 0 0.5, 0 0.6, 0 0.7, 0 0.8, and then 0 0.9. And then I want to extract the coordinates of these points directly from AutoCAD to Excel. So the first thing that I do is to click on this polyline, and then I'll draw a polyline from 0 0.1, 0 0.2, 0 0.3, 0 0.4, 0 0.5, 0 0.6, 0 0.7, 0 0.8, and 0 0.9. So, after drawing this polyline, what I do, I will just have to use a simple lisp, you know. I'll click a P. When I click AP, I'll click that upload, and then I'll browse to this folder of Lisp, and then there's this export Lisp, it's called VEXP, and then I'll load it. Then I click always load, and then I say close. So, this is an AutoCAD Lisp that can be used to export coordinates of each vertex, you know, into an Excel sheet. I have shared this Lisp with you. Just check for the download link in the description of this video. It's down there. Just click it and then it will automatically download the what? The AutoCAD Lisp, you know. And then after importing this Lisp, what you do, you come here to the command and then type in V and then E X P. You see this V E X P? Then click OK. When you click OK, it will prompt you to select where I want to save what? to save that CSV or the coordinates in the Excel format, you know? So let me save them to desktop here. And I'll select my name here as coordinates. Let me hope that's the spelling. Let me call them coordinates tutorial. Tutorial. And I click what? Save. So after that, as you see here, the, the command will tell me to select the lines and then polyline. So I'll click here and then select this line like this. And then I click enter. So after this step, the next thing you do is you go to where you have what? You have saved your what? Your coordinates or your Excel sheet and then open it, you know? And actually, when you open it, you'll see that this Lisp has been able to export your coordinates. This is the number, and this is the easting, and this is the nothing. And then sometimes the Z, if it's there. Yeah. So, guys, that's how you can actually export your coordinates from AutoCAD to Excel in a professional way. You don't have to hustle a lot. Just use this Lisp, and then you'll be good to go. Thank you for watching this tutorial. See you soon. 